What's up, what's up, what's up? All my Breebies out there, it's your girl, Brianka Janae, hitting you up with another video. That's right, only this time, I decided to pump my brakes just a little bit on the makeup video. I wanted to get back into my wigs because I've been rocking my shortcut because it has been extremely hot in Vegas. You're talking in Las Vegas, Nevada? We get about 117, 114, 123, 121. So with that being said, um, I've been rocking my shortcut and braids pretty much for the summer. So now that um, it is coming up out of summer, it's not as hot out here, um, I decided to start wearing my wigs just for a little bit and then I'll go back to my shortcut. I wanted to make sure that every wig that I'm showing you is affordable, okay? So this wig series is going to be um, showing you a lot of different um, styles that you can wear that are not expensive guys that are short sassy and cute and popping okay popping okay wait a minute I don't think I said it enough popping that's right popping so without further ado I'm gonna go ahead and get started and show you guys wig number one in this series which is honestly one of my favorites I've been rocking the wig um, for a little bit see is a bob it comes in a package that looks like this like I said I wore this wig already cuz I just couldn't wait y'all <laughs> I ain't gonna say you no lie um, I've been waiting at the door for these wigs okay uh, so when they came in the mail I was extremely excited um, these wigs came from um, samsbeauty.com which is where I order a lot of my wigs from um, I pretty much don't really buy them in the store anymore because they're the exact same wigs on salesbeauty.com. They just make the price ex more expensive. So what's the point of me paying you $30 for a wig when I can get it on just on um, Sam's Beauty for um, like 17, 18 bucks and just pay the shipping, which is four bucks. It comes out cheaper that way. Um, and then I can get more for my money, pretty much. And let me show you Miss Justy. Revamp okay. her just some baby hairs. Um, you see, I did a little bit with the part, just a little bit, because when I originally wore it, I'll try to insert some clips, I was like, like, not feeling it. Like, I'm out in public with a part that ain't even looking realistic, and I don't like my wigs to look wiggy. Of course, um, I am a cosmetologist, so cosmetologists don't walk around with parts that look wiggy, okay? So I had to do something, just a little bit of something, something to it, just a little bit. So I did pluck the part, um by taking the hairs like so and then just pulling them like this so taking them wrapping around my hand and pulling them and um all that good stuff all that good jazz i put a little bit of concealer in there but it wasn't a lot and so i'm gonna do the same um on camera because i was trying to save a lot of it in real time for you guys i, I don't like this um especially for me because i have a widow's peak uh widow's peak so we finna slay these edges and stuff together y'all now who wears their wigs like this not I says breathe. So let's hook it up. Let's hook it up. Let's go ahead and breathe ramp her up. So I'm just gonna slide this back just a little bit just to pull some of my hair and make it look realistic, honey. just a little bit like about right there or so just for right now because I'm gonna be um, um getting it together so I can lay the baby hairs and stuff so what I want to do now is I'm gonna I don't like this hairline I don't like the way that it looks so I'm just gonna take my comb and do like squiggly motions if that makes sense zigzag parting around my edges and pull the hair like so. Now that that may be a little bit too hair, too much hair. Ain't no maybe. That is too much hair. So then from there, I take it and I go like this because I hate when people make their baby hairs look like edges. I hate that. Like baby hairs are to be just that. Baby hair is not a whole nother piece of hair to chew and remix. Okay.
brow shaver just because it's it's a razor but it's a smart a smaller razor that I can have control with and I'm just gonna cut these going down okay just like so okay and cut those hairs off because I want them to be able to be laid down and I'm actually gonna go a little bit shorter because like I said these are to be baby hairs these jokers are not to be freaking edges okay y'all cut that out like cut that out if you if you take them piece by piece because you kind of want to do that anyway because you don't want to take too much off and then you'll mess up your wig you know so even though baby girl is inexpensive baby girl still still um was bought so baby girl still need the same tlc you feel me <laughs> baby girl don't need to be chasing waterfalls Edges, honey. Y'all know y'all be disrespectful with the baby hairs that be looking like edges. Y'all know. Like, the baby hair is not supposed to be all the way down here, okay? That's what I mean by you create edges. It just, it just does not look realistic. This is one of my favorite edge controls. This is called Black Fang. I got it from my um, local beauty supply store. I'm just, laying, I'm just putting some of this on my hair so that when I um, lay the baby hairs with it, it'll it'll pop. Like it'll it'll make my wig cute. Cause like I said, I have a little widow speak right here. I hate that, but I'm not gonna do about it. Okay. Baby girl looking more and more realistic, y'all. I am loving her. Woo! Just a girl. It does me so much justice, girl. Ooh, just a girl. Okay. So now I'm gonna take my toothbrush, okay? And you see how putting the, putting the edge control on my hair rather than on the hair from the wig did me a lot of justice, okay?
to cut any baby hairs right here in the front because it will mess up your vibe. Okay. All right, and so now I'm just going to take this brush right here. This is just a little cheap dollar um, brush from, I wanna say the Dollar Tree. And I'm going to put a little bit of concealer, just a little bit. This is LA Girl Pro Conceal and Fawn, okay? I'm gonna take a little bit of Fawn and put that into my part, including my hair right here, okay? Because you want it to look realistic. So if you have to shift baby girl, shift baby girl. But you want to put that right into that part like so. And there's a million and one videos on this, guys. Um, this video is more to show you what I like. This wig is a business, baby. Only $15. This wig, that is right, was only 15 bucks, y'all. And it looks so realistic. Like you would not even think that this is synthetic hair. It is extremely soft. It is definitely, definitely, definitely big head friendly. Cause I got a huge head as I see this massive juggler that I got, okay? And so this is uh, big head friendly, okay? Um, this is in the color number one. I'm definitely gonna go out and purchase this in a, um, a 1B27 or something like the ombre. I think that would be so freaking popping. Um, but let me show you guys the back, okay? So as you can see, this is the back. Turn around again. Oh, look at that whiplash action. I'm mean, being baby. <laughs> I don't got a new personality. <laughs> You can't tell Brie nothing, honey. You can't tell me nothing, okay? Miss Justy is the business. I'm going to leave a link in the description box, guys, of where you can get this wig. You could even take this off right here, which I may do later on, and just make this just a straight, blunt cut wig. No, um, no type of A-line or anything to it, just straight. Um, you can literally take this off right here and be good. Like, and wear it just like that. Okay? But I like mine, the way that this is going. This is pretty to me. This is beautiful to me. This is popping. Here's the part after I've done my little work to it. There's not a lot of work to this wig, y'all. Not a lot at all. And as I mentioned, it was inexpensive, guys. And if you're looking for something just to wear, like transitioning from the summer, <laughs> look. Okay. And I look like Kim K. <laughs> no, but it's cute. I definitely, definitely like it, guys. You guys head on over to samsbeauty.com and get yours today, guys. The link will be down below in the description box, guys. And as I always say here at Brevamp 702 TV, stay beautiful, stay confident, let no one else tell you any differently, okay? And if you are in the Las Vegas area and you are looking for a makeup artist, guys, I am definitely, definitely your girl, okay? My booking information will be down below in the description box as well. You guys have a good one.